Okay, welcome back to my Let's Play of Resident Evil 8 on the PC. We are going to continue with Ultra Wide. Um. Because I don't think it really... The, the, the issue is, if there is an issue, uh, that the processing time on YouTube is, is much longer with this higher resolution than if I were to just do 1080p, 16 by 9. Um, but... I don't think it's drastically horrible. So, you know, it, it's a trade-off, because I really would like playing in 21 by 9. So, I guess I would say, you know, if, uh, <laughs> if you want to view it above 360p, you know, you probably just have to wait a little bit. If you just wait like a day for every video, you'll be fine. Anyways, we're in this big spooky castle. We're trying to find, uh, uh, we're trying to find Mommy's, uh, room. I mean, uh, I'm sure she has a name. I want to say Alcina. Is that, is that right? Some sort of Cena, John Cena? No, it's not John's. It's it, it was something like that. I would really, I would really assume it to be upstairs. But yeah, aside from uh, the processing time, I think uh, the video looked good, turned out good, and all that. Yeah, you can't use this as is. What exactly does that mean? Oh, oh, no one wanted to tell me about that, huh? You like letting old man figure things out on his own. Well, now he did. I haven't cut open a man in a while. Me neither. Let me string you up. Slice your jugular. Taking a live, dead, which would you prefer? Uh, probably alive. I can't hold back any longer. Oh, Jesus. Your leg would be destroyed. Oh, nice. June 9th, 1958. It was my first day working at the castle today. I was most shocked to see the other staff. We're all women. The mistress and her daughters were very adamant that they wouldn't bite. It was quite peculiar. June 23, 1958. It's been two weeks since I started working at the castle, and I am a little... afraid. Another maid, Adela, made a mistake, and Miss Daniela slashed her face with a knife. And at night, I can hear wailing as if ghosts roam the halls. I want to go home. July 8, 1958. I don't know what to do. The young ladies were complaining it was too hot and stuffy during dinner, so I opened the window just a crack. Shut it! Shut it now! They all shrieked at me in unison. I fear I may be taken down into the cellar, never to be seen of again. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Hmm. He's long dead. 
Right. So they're, they're vampires. They don't like sunlight. Blah, 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 blah. I'm sure that's how we'll kill at least one of them. Oh, here we go now. Here we go. A little, little peep show. Oh, okay. Never mind. Ammo. How did that record player turn off on its own? Fascinating. Trust in light. Okay. Yeah. All right. I like that. Come on. Get out. Yeah. Thank you. It's mighty dark in here. Oh, there we go. It's covered in dried blood. Help me, brother. Brother. Uh, okay. Ooh, yummy. Yeah, it's, uh, uh, oppressively quiet, I would say. That's how I would describe it. Candidates, Irina, Mihaela, Lois, Ingrid, Rejects, Dandora, Greta, Nadine, Camellia, Bianca, Melina, Astrid, Ludmilla, Rosalinda, Lena, Stefana, Gabriella. Those sound all like females. Candidates to become new vampires, perhaps. Irina, robust appetite. Mihaela, robust appetite. Lois, robust appetite. Ingrid, unstable, overly alert at times. Hmm. You know, I think probably on my tombstone it'll say, robust appetite, unstable, overly alert at times. So that's a nice coincidence. I think there might be some wolf men. <clears throat> a little bit of wolf action. Oh, that was that was special metal scrap. It wasn't rusted. Mm -hmm. 
Why is the music like crescendoing? That's a fucking battle axe. Be nice if I actually got the battle axe. But no, it evaporated. But Crystal Skull is good. Music seems to tell me that there's, yeah, more enemies. All right, calm down, Ethan. A pipe bomb. But of course. What gothic dungeon doesn't have a pipe bomb laying around? I know mine does. Do I use the pipe bomb? That's the question. Might as well. Got an achievement for it. And we got Ingrid's necklace. Music's still there. ambushed from behind and they're crawling out the woodwork so let's be cautious other crystal skulls good yeah okay can't go prone Did someone, did one of them come out of that hole? Jesus. Hey, horrible. All right, let's make some first aid med. Mm. Not go overboard on handgun ammo if I don't need to, because we might want to make some shotgun shells down the line. Eventually, a family photo will be useful. I can't believe Cassandra caused yeah. all this mess. Yuck. Put your hands down, Ethan. I gotta see shit. Get out of my way, biatch. Quit your games. You're tonight's main dish. I mean, honestly, if anyone's playing games, I think it's you. Because you just slowly walk towards me instead of just, like, lunging at me. Where are you going, little one? <laughs> Bullets cannot harm. <laughs> 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 You stupid man thing! Ugh. I feel no pain! Yeah? This is How dare you bear your teeth at us! Jeez. Okay. This can't be! Not like this. Damn. 
Damn, I took her tits. A fine prize. Wow, I already dealt with one of the daughters. Color me surprised. Sanguis virginis. Another one was sent to the cellar. She had only spilled some soup. Everyone knows what happens when you're sent to the cellar. You're never seen again. They drain your blood, your soul cursed to wander the halls. I went looking for her, and when I found her, she was just skin and bones and gnawing on a rat carcass. I suspect it'll be my turn next. You know what would be kind of interesting? And maybe I don't really want this, and I'm just saying it purely because I think it would be interesting. Oh, recoil compensator for my pistol. Yes. Good. Um, is like a Castlevania game in this sort of Somewhat in this style, uh, this aesthetic, you know, like a grim, dark, first-person Castlevania game. Instead of a gun and stuff, you have, like, a whip and throwing knives and things. Like, just a much scarier, like, kind of grounded, somewhat, Castlevania game. I don't know if it would really be a good concept. Um, I don't know. It just seems like the Castlevania franchise is kind of languishing. I, I'd be fine with another just like 2D Metroidvania kind of game, but I don't know, something fresh and new. I mean, you know, they did something fresh and new for Resident Evil. Yes, indeed. Isn't this where Big Big Titted shows up? I don't know, I might be misremembering stuff from the demo Shall that I... Nope. <laughs> Fuck. Oh. Fuck. How's it feel? Don't distract me. I'm busy. <laughs> no? Okay, yeah. In the demo... You got stopped at that point. <laughs> but that was the end of the demo, so it makes sense. <laughs> yeah, maybe the family photo will work. It's got to work one of these times. How did she not hear me come in? This place is deathly silent. I should have went to Duke. What have you done to my daughter? Ooh. 
because I could definitely use some shoddy ammo. Great. One of these. Do we turn them to face one another or do we turn to face the wall? It's anybody's guess, really. No, okay. What does it mean? What what does it all what does it all mean? It can't be that complicated because they can only be in two one of two positions. This is, is the only rotation they can make. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, maybe I'm underthinking it. Okay, so we got three dudes offering up some grapes. We've got a woman of high society with a goblet. We've got some sort of priestly woman holding a bottle. And a man on a horse. What could it possibly mean? Oh, there might be a plaque that explains things. Women are blind to male advances, but the poor shall take their chances to give their lord their bounty sown so that soon the wine may flow. Women are blind to male advances. Okay, I'm surprised that's not right. Women are blind to male advances. But she'll take a chance. The poor shall take their chances, give their lord their bounty so Oh, no, no, no. Poor shall take their chance. And women are blind. Yeah. Well, who'd have thunk that a clue would actually be useful? This is just a f basement flooded with blood. Of course. Hmm. It's pretty fishy, man. Pretty fishy, man. You don't actually have to switch your knife. And... Whoa! Everybody be taking a bite out of me.
A pistol upgrade, baby. No, don't. Don't do that. We don't need to do that. Maybe if I was playing on hell difficulty or something. Yeah, it's uh, just good old fashioned. Jesus. Shit. Herbs and scraps. Good, good, good. I think instead of firing off a shot when they jump out, I should I should do this. It's just like one of those old shooting games in the arcade. Crystal skull. Where you at, Duke? Oh, yeah, this I like. Eva Rooney. Smash that shit. has an identical dress in the corner. She casts a reflection. Mother Miranda, I regret to inform you that Ethan Winters has escaped that fool Heisenberg. Because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him. No, Mother Miranda. Yes, of course, I understand the importance of the ceremony. I won't let you down. Oh, oh. To hell with the ceremony! That man will pay for what he's done. Oof. And I would say, oh, well, she doesn't cast a reflection because she's not really a, you know, vampire. She's some sort of <sighs> infected monster that drinks blood. Um, except for, you know, the whole burning in sunlight thing. So I don't know. Or maybe the daughters? Are, I don't know. Uh... We were all called by Mother Miranda to decide the fate of the child's father. Just thinking of that family meeting makes me shudder. To think I am treated like a sister to those miscreants. Especially Heisenberg. That riffraff wouldn't know proper manners if they slapped him in the face. I would have sliced him to ribbons if Mother hadn't stopped me. Why? Why does she treat me the same as them? She gave me this castle. Obedient daughters. Everlasting life. Did she not? Am I not her favorite? Am I not special? 
I need a drink. Rose, where are you? That's a good question. Okay, so this is locked from the other side. This is just locked. Ah. Give me trace key. That might do the job. Oh shit. Oh shit. All this for a child who isn't even here. <laughs> what the hell do ah! You ungrateful, selfish wretch! You come into my house! You lay your filthy man hands on my daughters! And now you even try to steal my property! How dare you! Rest while you can! Because I will hunt you! And I will break you! Okay, but you could have just go ahead. Do your worst. Could have just snapped my neck, or impaled me, or ripped me in half, or bitten my dick off. I mean, you could have done so many things, but you basically just sent me away, and then said you're gonna hunt me, even though you're really pissed off. So I don't know what to think. Nah. <sighs> Hmm. Sort of labyrinthine hallways. Definitely make me feel like a confrontation is incoming. <laughs> Oh my god. Blackheart let you get away. You'll be sliced to ribbons. Before you ever see me, child. I feel like this is going to impact my ability to use firearms. Can I feel like you're not really trying to kill me? Let's wrap Fuck things up quick. My ass. How did she do that trick? Be getting somewhere. Oh yeah, that'll do it. That'll do it. All better. Oh my god. No. No what? What? Why would you even think that that would be possible? Good. Good. Man, screw this castle. What the fuck? I feel... I feel like this game is from some alternate universe where shit like that is just normal. 
and they don't have to explain it because it's just like, yeah, well, of course, you, there's chem fluid, and you, you just put it on your arm, and you can reattach limbs. And <laughs> good. Like, what? Is there some lore entry that I'm not familiar with? It just says it heals. I mean, I look. Uh, look, I know you have video games, right? And you just say it, that you're healed, and you heal. But then, when you have narrative things like losing a fucking limb, usually there are consequences to that. What was even the point? What was even the point of cutting off my limb? Instead of just like, shock value. And then, uh, nah, you're fine. Don't even worry about it. It won't impair you whatsoever. It's like it never happened. Maybe when I was a kid, shit, I wouldn't even say that. I'd have been like, wow, that's cool. But you know what, Capcom? It's not cool. You can't just break the laws of reality without explaining that shit. Because it has to be... <laughs> it has to be some established thing in-universe. Because otherwise, why would he even try it? No normal human would ever have dumped this, like... antiseptic... on their severed arm, and then just stick their hand there. And just be like, oh, yeah, okay. Look, yeah, it reattached itself instantly with no uh, imperfection. Good. It's just... It's just bonkers. I don't want to craft too much, because I keep thinking we'll find Duke, but maybe we won't find Duke. Yeah, I don't know. Unless this is Duke. No. Alright, then I don't expect to see him in the near future. Please be aware the mistress's lipstick is missing. If anyone finds it, could they please return it to her bathroom? It is custom made and therefore very expensive. Grand Chambermaid. I think heads will be rolling for that. One day since treatment, the three girls have stopped moving. They seem almost dead. An insect flew out of the eldest's mouth. It appears to be a common fly. Two days since treatment, all three bodies are covered in flies. It appears the flies are consuming their flesh. When I opened a window, some of the flies dropped dead to the floor. It would seem the cold petrifies them. I quickly closed the window to avoid weakening the insects further. Oh... Oh, okay, so it wasn't the sunlight. It was cold. So that they complained about it being hot at one point, so someone opened a window, and that was too cold. Maybe then, if your one fucking weakness is cold, uh, don't post up <laughs> in, you know, uh, an icy northern region. Four days since treatment. All three bodies have almost been completely consumed by the insects. All that is left is a dark, writhing, human-shaped mass of creatures. It is just after noon, and the insects have started to change color. Those who are on the face turn pale, and those who are on the lips turn a deep crimson. Six days since treatment. The mass of insects have transformed into human bodies again. 
All three girls awoke, looking at me like newborns. I sense a bond between us, like mother and daughters. I have already decided their names. Bella, Daniela, and Cassandra. All right, so they're just masses of insects that took the form of hot vampire chicks. As one does. Um... But yeah, move to South America or something. Fuck, that scared me. Try the equator. I hear it's warm. I don't know if I want to go down yet. I might want to clear this floor. how much you use the pistol and how little you use the shotgun that's why you upgrade the pistol <laughs> flower swords ball I've always wanted one of those I can't... I don't know anything about music. Oh, it's honestly gibberish. This could be in wingdings for all I know. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Oh, it's, it's very generous. Okay, good. Because otherwise... You know, us music idiots would be pretty lost. That's nice. Good thing Ethan's <laughs> mangled hands can do that. Scientific name, none. Size, five to six centimeters. Similar body structure to blowflies, although there are differences in the head. They are carnivorous and vigorously consume meat. In order to catch unsuspecting prey, they'll gather using pheromones to mimic a human. They are produced when a kadu lays eggs in its host, but the flies themselves are unable to reproduce. They are weak to sudden drops in temperature, especially if the temperature drops below 10 degrees Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Their metabolism lowers and they go into a dormant cryptobiotic state. Similar to the cryptobiosis of tardigrade or polypetalum van der Planke. Now you're just making up words. What did I get for playing the piano? I'm a... <laughs> I mean, on the one hand, I'm an idiot. But on the other hand, you gotta give me credit for actually thinking about it. When I could have very easily just wandered around for an hour. I don't think it's... No, it's not this. Yeah, maybe we should go back to Duke. Um...
Oh, we can open the Hall of Pleasure. Ooh. Well, then. Say no more. doing in here oh another crystal skull don't mind if I do it's going straight into Duke's hands It's a pleasure to see you safe. How were things? No sign of Rose. I'm so sorry it turned out that way. Well, you'll find your way to her once you're out of this castle. Do you have need of anything for the road ahead? Welcome, welcome. Um, you're sure to find something. I mean, I feel like I could have pretty easily gotten out of new. Castle. I await your patronage. Shut up, Duke. Busy with this. Yep, that was incorrect. Oh, well, let's just do the whole thing over again. That sounds good. Why can't I just place the ball in the slot? God, video games. Ugh. Yeah, of course, it's the middle one. I mean, this, this isn't as egregious as the fucking hand thing, but... Still, just just put it in the hole and you'll be done. You're trying to find your dar. Why are you fucking around like this? Oh, I'm trying to get it into the... I'm trying to avoid all the holes. Right, get to the light. Yes, well, let's just do this again because it's so much fun. Can't see shit. Nice, gotcha. Crimson skull. So it's just money, basically. Shall I choose something for? You? Boom! Five grand. For uh, her, her chest. Eight thousand for that crimson skull. Oh my god. Oh, and I actually have a lockpick. Now to spend like kings. <laughs> um. think it's really worth it to upgrade anything else with the pistol. Rate of fire doesn't matter, because we really only use the pistol when it's, uh, you know, one-on-one -on -one or so. When it's manageable targets, and I can just slowly aim for the head. Reload speed. It already reloads pretty quick. It's not even that big of a... 2.7 to 2.5? That's... Uh, my ass. You think that point two is gonna save your life? Uh, and then ammo capacity from 10 to 12, again, it's just like so negligible. I'm not gonna waste my money. 
Uh, shotgun, probably, yeah. Power. 560 to 640. Mm, what's the percentage increase on that? Hmm. <laughs> These it's like I want to say it's like twelve percent. I'm not a math whiz, but around about twelve, thirteen percent. Uh, say thirteen percent increase for eight thousand. Yeah, because there's more upgrades down the line, according to this. So these hands are more dexterous than one yeah. might think. Okay, but then the rest is all going into other purchases. <sighs> Greatly increased rate of fire, uh, ammo capacity. I think we really are just looking for. Yeah, we want this. We want to make shotgun ammo. Huh. Making mines. I think that would actually be... Mines are almost certainly like a one-shot kill on yes, a lot of stuff. I can see why you'd be interested in that. I think we want to... So these are 1000 bucks per shell. Uh -huh. It's outrageous. Uh-huh. Yeah. Securing okay. goods is more. Please come again. He didn't even sell handgun ammo. So... Oh, and you need chem fluid as part of shotgun ammo. Yeah, we're actually a little restricted. Mines, though, are... It's one rusted scrap, one metal scrap. So metal scrap... But yeah, I mean, if you consider that each one of these creatures takes like six bullets to sh kill, you could place a mine that could kill like three of them in one go. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty good. All right. I'm not overflowing with ammunition or anything, but we're doing okay. We're doing okay. We'll leave it off there. My name is Mang. Game watching has been Resident Evil 8. I'll see you fine folks in the next part.